Hello once again, Internet. It's me, Carmen, coming right back at you from good old Beaver Dam Park in Gloucester, Virginia. It's almost closing, but I figured I'd come down here, enjoy the beautiful nature trails, and take it all in while I'm talking about what's on my mind. You know, I've been thinking a lot lately about being compassionate for your fellow human being. It's something that we're not all perfect at. I can't say I'm always perfect at showing compassion when compassion is needed, but... I try to, as much as possible, try to put my best foot forward, my best self out there. But it's hard sometimes, especially when we're all so tired and worn out and sleep deprived, sleepy, tired. Doesn't make for necessarily the most understanding of pretenses. Now that being said, we should try to get the right amount of sleep and try to make sure we are well nourished, we're keeping up with ourselves and that our needs are attended to. With thinking about that, we also have to remember all the other people around us who are very tired, very out of it. There's a lot going on around us in our world. You go to a place like this, you wouldn't really think it, but we have so much going on in our lives. Just think about everything, even if it's not you, maybe a friend of yours, everything they have to do in their life, or a family member who works maybe two jobs to keep food on the table, or whatever example. Not everyone is in those scenarios. Some people have barely anything going off their lives just because of pure circumstance. But the point I'm trying to make is I guess we have to be understanding and excusing. I think that's the closing bell. I should probably turn around now of other people's circumstances. And at the same time, we have to be forgiving of ourselves. Now, what does it mean to be forgiving of ourselves? It means... To not be so hard on ourselves when we do mess up, we do do something wrong, because we are human. We make mistakes. That's the nature of the game. I just guess compassion has been on my mind, because I haven't necessarily been perfect at myself. I've had a lot of times lately where I really feel like I haven't stepped up to the plate in my own personal life as much as I should have. And I think it's something we're all working on every day even if we're very compassionate people already i think it's always something that can be worked on how much compassion we show to the world well i guess it would depend maybe if you're the dalai lama or you're just a very good person which i don't really know if we're able to judge ourselves like that i certainly don't think i could judge my compassion like that just say okay i've done all the good i can do <laughs> it's just time to stop doing good i don't think that's something that's really that easy to judge I don't know guys, I don't have all the answers, but I actually made this video because I wanted to start a discussion. I want to hear what you guys have to say in the comments below about compassion, compassion for ourselves, compassion for other people. This is sort of a cataclyst to get some discussion going on the topic. I think compassion is always a good thing to talk about, and we can rarely ever have enough compassion. Thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, be sure to leave a thumbs up. All of my social media links are in the description below. Have a happy Friday. This is just a quick one. Peace out.